and welcome to my channel i hope all of my beautiful and my handsome scorpios out there are doing well all right y'all so we're gonna pull some angel numbers and we're gonna see what messages spirit wants to share with you guys okay and then we're gonna pull some more okay so if anything resonates for you don't forget to like share subscribe and comment and if you're interested in a personal scorpio or anything else that you want to know about me will be in the description box below all right, Scorpios, let's go. All right, Holy Spirit, what is it that you need Scorpio to know at this time? We'll start off with this part. All right, messages for Scorpio. Okay. Now we had we had one for four years today. Okay, so I'm gonna take this out because we had this the other day. Okay, Scorpio, so you could be seeing lots of fours, okay? I think earlier I said something about 444, four, four, but we have 44, okay? So this means, Scorpio, that you have mastered something in your life, okay? 44 is a master number. This is a symbol of positive energy, especially if you've been going through a difficult time, okay? So I feel like maybe you guys have been through something, you know what I'm saying? But it's like you mastered that shit. It was something you had to go through, but you mastered it, Okay. Now spirit is about to send you some positive energy, okay? God is protecting and wrapping his arm around you to bring you love and hope, okay? So something that you went through, Scorpio, been rough. She been rough for me too, Scorpio, okay? So I'm I'm wrapping my arms around you and Holy Spirit is wrapping their arms around you, okay? To show you love and support and to give you hope on this journey. Because they want you, Scorpio, to move forward with courage okay even though like especially on any type of journey we on scorpio ain't none of this shit easy okay but we wouldn't have been chosen to be on this journey if they knew we weren't gonna make it okay they knew shit was gonna be rough for us they knew it but they knew at the end scorpio we could push through we just have to remember shit we strong as fuck shit think about all the things that you've been through in life already and how you came out on the other side it's just another little hurdle some hurdles be big as fuck, though, Scorpio. I'll be like, shit, do I need to be stretched arm strong in this month? I can just stretch my arm all over. Or my leg on over this hurdle, Lord, okay? But they just want to learn how to move forward with courage. Anytime, any obstacle, any hurdles, anything, any crisis, anything we have in our life, spirit just don't always want us to stay in that stuck-ass energy, okay? They want, our, want us to feel our feelings, you know what I'm saying? Go through the shit, experience the shit, but then learn how to move forward with courage, okay? Don't let fear prevent us from, from doing shit in our life, making us happy. Then we got seven. You could be seeing 777. Seven, seven. You could have been born on 11, 7, a Scorpio. You could be 20, 22, or 44. Your angels want you to take up a new hobby or skill, okay? Some of you guys have been thinking about, you know, a new hobby or skill. It's been something that's kind of intrigued you here lately. This is going to enhance you or inform you of your spiritual gifts. So some of you haven't really wanted to know about what your spiritual gifts are, what your divine purpose is. What exactly are you here to do, okay? Taking a, a new hobby or skill. Some of you could be interested in tarot. You know what I'm saying? I've been thinking about Scorpio doing a little things, maybe holding a little class or something like that. You know what I'm saying? But some of you could be interested in becoming tarot card readers. You know what I'm saying? Y'all see, I still got my book and use it very faithfully and probably will always do that. Because I want to make sure I get all the messages out, right? But whatever you do, Scorpio, this could also lead you down your new career path. Some of you been wanting a new career. You're like, uh-uh, we playing. This ain't it. I get you, baby. Before I got on this path, baby, like all my jobs and shit, them shits wasn't it. <laughs> them shits wasn't it either, Scorpio. It just paid the bills. You know what I'm saying? But you tired of just paying the fucking bills, Scorpio. You want to be happy. You know what I'm saying? You want to feel safe and secure. And you want to be happy going to work. So taking up a new hobby or a new skill, Scorpio, can help possibly inform you of your spiritual gifts, okay? And that, that gift, Scorpio, was going to lead you down a new career path. All right, you guys. So let's pull these messages here. 
And let's see what it is. Let me see the red is for you because I pulled from these myself the other day, okay? <laughs> All right, messages for my Scorpio. What is it that Scorpio needs to know, Holy Spirit? All right, Scorpio, look at this. Perseverance, seven, seven, seven. Man, I can't make this shit up. Look at this shit, Scorpio. You see them seven? Okay, seven, 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 Scorpio. Spirit just out. Look at them hurdles. Man, come through, Spirit. Oh, my God. Okay, now. I just happened to look and see them damn hurdles. Okay, now, Spirit. You better come on through for you, girl. I love it, y'all. I love my spirit guys come through today. I mean, it just it just amazing. It just makes you feel good, okay? I feel like Scorpio that you've experienced a lot of challenges in your life. You was like, ooh, can we just get a resolution, Lord? You know what I'm saying? You like a leader. You just want a resolution. You tired of having to jump over these hurdles and go through all this bullshit. But spirit just wants you to always know the shit you can endure in this, anything, Scorpio, even though you have challenges, even though all these bullshit seem to just happen in your life. It ain't just yours, baby. It's all of us. But I feel the same way. But they knew the whole time before that challenge even came, we was going to persevere. We may not know this shit, but they knew that shit. It was set up that way. You know, you, you think they're going to put us on the path? They knew we was going to fail, Scorpio? Hell no. It was set up for us to fail. You know what I'm saying? The path that we're set on, it was destined for us to succeed. But shit, we got to know that we're going to be successful. How spirit going to put us on the path to success and bless us with all this, this money and great fortune and material and spiritual wealth? The hell, we don't even think we're going to succeed. This motherfucker got on the whole business suit running this hurdle, okay? He ain't even took off his work clothes. Some of us, Scorpio, still been trying to work while we've been going through these challenges and obstacles and, and hurdles. I know the fuck I have. <laughs> All I've been trying to do is fucking work. And it seems like the fucking obstacle and hurdle I got is trying to work. <laughs> this man still got on his business suit, baby. <laughs> you see this? I ain't never stopped running the race. Still been going to work. Still been going strong, okay? Tell us more, Holy Spirit. You gotta talk to me. See, I feel like sometimes even as my past work for y'all as a reader. You know what I'm saying? Like, messages be for me too i be going through shit too you know what i'm saying like i say that all the time i don't just be telling y'all this shit just to be saying this shit like i'm for real shit y'all see i ain't seen my face since i did that damn thing the other day like this shit is real <laughs> and it's nothing i'm ashamed of you know scorpio i'm the type of person i don't know about y'all like i usually isolate myself so to me this is like okay they can't see the pain and the shit i'm going through right now you know what i'm saying but i'm still gonna be i'm still working Shit, I may not be showing my face, but bitch, I'm still, I'm still in work mode. <laughs> Let's go, Scorpio. All right, Scorpio. Ooh, look at this, Scorpio. And for that, Scorpio, because you kept on moving forward with courage on this, on this journey, even though you experience all these challenges and obstacles in your damn way, Scorpio. Look, the universe gonna gift you. I done did a couple of readings. about about people who didn't do what they supposed to been doing. But it's about us, Scorpio, because you did. What the fuck you was supposed to do. The universe is about to gift you. Some of you guys, this new career path you're going to go through, go on. Baby, this is going to be a promotion. You're going to go in and apply for one position, Scorpio. You're going to get granted with another one. You're like, I ain't even apply for that shit. It don't matter. Take that shit, Scorpio. Walk out the door and be like, shit, thank you. And get on your knees and, knees and thank Holy Spirit for that shit, okay? That's going to be your blessing. Because you stayed on that last job way longer, Scorpio, than what you were supposed to. Spirit so had to keep you stuck there because they had to create a new door. You know, a lot of us don't understand why we be stuck for so long. Because shit, Spirit got to create these opportunities. You say Spirit, I mean, yes. Spirit, is, Holy God is the ma magician, okay? Holy Spirit represents the magician in the tarot. But shit, some shit got to be moved around, Scorpio. I don't know if y'all don't understand. Like, life, motherfucking life. It's like playing the game of chess. Like you got to be very strategic. Spirit got to be very strategic on these moves that they make with us. They just can't be placing us any old fucking where, especially not his chosen. No. So sometimes it takes time for shit to move into play. But she got to move around in the background before it even move her on the 3D. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like Scorpio, because you never gave up. Even though the times got rough, baby, you know you cried, you had to maybe drink and smoke a little bit more than what you did. I know I had, y'all. Shit. <laughs> oh, Lord. It got rough. But we didn't give up. I ain't give up, Scorpio. 
Like, shit, you don't think I be wanting to give up? I ain't gonna be like, fuck this shit, but just be like, come on, man. Like, can we, can I get something else, Lord? Like, shit, now. You gonna get a gift? <laughs> For some of you guys, this gift gonna be a souvenir. Like, this gonna be some shit that everybody gonna see. You see this? For some of you, this gift you gonna get, it's gonna be a souvenir. Like, everybody gonna see this shit. I feel like all the gifts, all the blessings we gonna get, Still so gonna put it out there for everybody to see. We had a lot of people, Scorpio, that was doubting us. That we weren't gonna never do shit. We weren't ever gonna be shit in our life and shit. Little did they know, little did we know. Shit, God had a whole bigger plan in store for us. And we ain't even know about this shit. I ain't even know about this shit till now, Scorpio. Look at this adventure. For some of you guys, the gift that you're gonna have, baby, is that you're about to be on a lot of adventures, Scorpio. I'm very motherfucking adventurous. I don't like being in one place. That's my problem now. And shit, I can't move the way I want to. You know what I'm saying? My physical body won't allow me to, okay? Some of you guys, you can stay like in Colorado or where there's a lot of mountains and Scorpio. Maybe you like to go mountain climbing or I feel like there's something you're going to be doing like wintertime. Maybe you like to do stuff. You like to be adventurous in the winter. I don't know much. We don't have, we have winter here, but you know we don't have a lot of snow and shit. So, you know, we, it's some mountains here. So them shit's up north. You know what I'm saying? So, but you could just be doing something where you're going to become very adventurous. You know what I'm saying? You may do shit you ain't never thought you was going to do before. You're going to be exploring the world, Scorpio. But you're going to be very passionate. Like, whatever you do, that passion is never going to leave your side, okay? And I feel like, Scorpio, some of you guys are going to do a lot of travel. That's going to be your gift. Look at that. Leap of faith. Zero. Some of you guys gonna be taking a lot of leap of faith, and you be doing a lot of shit. You gonna become very adventurous, and you gonna be doing a lot of shit, Scorpio, that you never thought that you would have ever imagined doing in your whole life, Scorpio. I ain't never flown full. Uh -huh. I ain't never been on a plane before. Let me say, cause I was gonna fuck all that up. All my countryside was gonna come out. <laughs> I've never been on a plane before, Scorpio, cause I'm scared of heights. But do I want to fly? Hell yeah! I just don't know. I'm like shit. I'm gonna have to be super high. Man, I take me a couple of shots, like, but I want to enjoy the shit. So I don't want to be too fucked up, but I just feel like that anxiety because I don't do roller coasters, I don't climb trees, I don't do none of that shit that that, that involves me going in high places. Now I like to be like up here. I stay upstairs. It's cool looking there. I even like looking out for my bedroom. I'm like, this shit is kind of cool. I might want me a little two story house or something up high. You know, this is help. Some of us get over our fears. I don't know about y'all, but that's my biggest fear. Shit, I don't want to fly no damn way. But I want to. I want to, but I don't want to. You know? I need somebody to fly with me, to be be in my ear the whole time. Be like, bitch, it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. <laughs> That's how I need to. It's going to be okay. Yes, bitch, it's going to be okay. <laughs> you could be seeing zero, 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 Scorpio. You could be 30 feet. See one more, Holly Spirit. All right, Scorpio. I mean, it was all because, Scorpio, you weren't scared. Look at this. We got fright. In reverse, okay? Now, Scorpio, on these journeys and some of these challenges that, 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 that we've been on, yeah, Scorpio, I done been depressed at one point in time. Look at I'm talking about phobias. You better come through, Spirit. Okay? So I guess Spirit telling me, don't be scared, bitch, because you won't, you won't have to catch the flight somewhere. <laughs> I guess he said, don't be scared, Sherry, because your ass won't have to catch the damn flight some damn word too, okay? But Spirit, it was all because we weren't scared. This is in reverse, okay? We weren't scared. We might have went through some things, Scorpio, but we never was scared. We was always up for the challenge. We was always up for the fight. You know what I'm saying? What Bone Crusher say, we ain't never scared, okay? And I ain't gonna never be scared, okay? I fucking love y'all, Scorpio. I just wanna say that shit. I'm gonna show my face eventually, y'all. Let me get through these next couple weeks. Shit, there's a lot of shit going on, Scorpio. And the moon cycles, all them shit's fuck with me. Like, I always tell y'all this, so. When y'all don't see me, y'all all be like, all right, we find it. it must be some shit, yeah. I ain't gonna say it's always some shit going on or no shit like that, but it's just the energy, baby. I got to have the energy to, you know, to have the energy. <laughs> Either way, you guys, I love y'all. I know some of y'all like, maybe you won't give a fuck we see your face tonight. As long as you give us these messages, that's all we want. Okay, I got you, boo. All right, y'all. Until next time, what I want y'all to do, stay blessed. Y'all even got my eight-year-old saying that shit. He's walking around. Stay blessed. <laughs>